Hey everybody, Graham here at the end of December with another YouTube update. And before we start looking forward, let's first look back at the year that was 2023. Uh, we had a couple rough years there, but 2023, at least the back half of it, really felt like finally getting our feet under us and feels good. It's, uh, it's, it's a nice feeling. That said, we did move, but that was our choice, which is different from all the other stuff. And now we are here in Moonbase Mark VI. Eventually, we will show you some more in-depth behind-the-scenes stuff. But for now, have we shown you around? We should show you around. Here, one sec. Come with me. This is the new friend zone. It's full of places to sit and ways we can listen to records, which is nice. This is the kitchen where food and stuff happen. We recently recorded a mail time, and so it's full of candy at the moment. This is sort of the main hallway where on one side we have little rooms that are offices for people to work and edit videos in. And on the other side are studios to make those videos like Studio A, which we're not gonna go into right now because they're literally live. We call this room cold storage where we put things that we don't really need but can't bear to throw away. This is the server closet. It's cold and loud in here, but it's where we keep this ridiculous thing and other storage. It's really cold. This is Studio B, where we do podcasts, and through the power of nonlinear time, I'm actively recording this very video right now. This is our bathroom. We have a Japanese butt cleaning toilet seat. Isn't that fun? This is the tech room where we keep our cameras and cables and things, and also where we have the station so that the audio video engineers, usually Paul, can look through into Studio B and also look through into Studio C where we'll go in a moment. This is the other exit of the tech room into where we keep our props and costumes at the far end of what is now Studio C, the largest room in the moon base with our set for Loading Ready Live and the set for AFK where we do all the magic stuff. There's so much room for activities. Woo! We also have a secret bathroom, but I'm not gonna tell you how to get here. There's also these weird stairs, but nobody's ever gone higher than step number five. Go to six, I dare you. <laughs> nice. 2023 has also been our 20th anniversary. Believe me, we feel much weirder about that than you do, but we had a lot of fun celebrating it with things like the 20th anniversary retrospective series, which will be wrapping up shortly, the retro sketch remakes of the Quantum Documentary and the Alternative to Telemarketers, and the Professor's Funhouse, which is either upcoming or has aired, depending on when this goes out to you. But we filmed it at time of recording. And of course, we had the week-long subathon, which was just a great time for all of us here, and everyone at home seemed to enjoy it. If you missed any part of it, it is all available up across the various VOD channels, and there's a unified playlist for you to enjoy. And that probably won't be the last subathon you see from us. I don't think we're going to wait another 20 years. And, possibly most importantly, this is the fourth of the video updates that we said that we would do four of. So, nailed it. And now, looking ahead, the Friday Nights Kickstarter is finally live. We wanted to launch this in April 2020, and we thought, maybe let's hold off for a week. And then things took a turn, but it's happening now. So tell your friends, if you want to check out some new Friday Nights, then please help support that campaign and uh, we'll, we'll do it, finally. Believe me, we have also been wanting to bring back Friday Nights, and now now we can do that. But you won't be seeing finished episodes of Friday Nights until later in 2024, so what can you possibly entertain yourselves with between now and then? Well, great news, because Corpline is on the horizon. Yes, season three of Corpline, recorded some time ago, but for a variety of reasons, some of which will be obvious to you when you listen to it, has taken a while to get out the door, will be coming your way in January. And also in January, some temporary changes to the streaming schedules for AFK and Crossing the Streams, in that they will be combining their powers in the Monday night slot. Because, for a while at least, we need the Wednesday night slot to produce some new dice friends. Magic the Gathering is returning to Ravnica, and so are we with Bylaw and Order 2. 
So the Wednesday night AFK slot will be on hiatus for a couple weeks while we start to record that, and then we will be airing Dice Friends in the Wednesday night AFK slot starting late January. Hopefully you are all as excited to return to the 6th District as Kathleen and the players are. Meanwhile, we are excited to return to Chicago. That's right, it's MagicCon Chicago. Seven of our most magical players will be there. We'll be hosting our traditional Loading Ready Run Chaos event, as well as a couple signing blocks where we will sign, I don't know, whatever you want to bring us within reason. Also, and again, we say this every time, if you see us around the con, we're there to meet folks and say hi. So, you know, as long as we're not actively tanking a particularly difficult turn of a commander game uh, feel free to stop us and say hi and we'll sign stuff or take pictures that is why we are there we're excited to meet you to clarify we're not going to have a booth at magic con chicago so if you want to give us money for merchandise you'll have to do that at store.loadingreadyrun.com penultimately depending on what social media you are into here are some ways that you can interact with what is an excellent community i think i'm extremely biased but y'all are great we have of course our discord at discord.gg slash LRR. Terrific bunch of folks in there. You can follow us on Instagram, where James has been posting some cool photos and behind-the-scenes stuff. You can still follow us on Twitter, though it's mostly going live notifications. You can follow us on Mastodon on kind.social, where you should also sign up if you're looking to join Mastodon. And we do have a TikTok, and maybe we'll post up there again. But, I mean, I don't know. I Check it out. And of course, a reminder that we're all over YouTube in different forms. We have this channel, Loading Ready Run. We've got the magic stuff over on LRRMTG. We've got video game stuff at LRRVG. And we've got tabletop stuff where the Dice Friends will live at LRRTT, as well as my vlogs at Graham Stark Vlogs and the stream channel, Loading Ready Live, where you see all the stream VODs that aren't on some of those other channels that I just mentioned. And finally, of course, a reminder that the reason we're able to do all of these things that we do is because of your direct support. It's most important that you're just here and that you watch and that you hang out and that you tell your friends. That's what is honestly the biggest difference maker. But if you are able to support us financially, it is a huge help. And you can do that a couple different ways on our Patreon at patreon.com slash loading ready run. Or for those of you who subscribe or give bits over on twitch.tv slash loading ready run or becoming a member here on YouTube, or giving super thanks on YouTube. A phrase I still can't really say with a straight face just because it sounds very strange, but a super you're welcome to all who give us super thanks. You can also just send money directly to PayPal, though. That feels weird. <laughs> but, I mean, hey, go for it. The point is, thank you. It's been an interesting year, 2023, but we're really excited for what's coming up 2024. And, uh, hey, 20 more years? Why not? What else have we got going on? <clears throat> hey, thanks everybody. Really appreciate it. Oh, hey, one more thing, or sort of one more thing. Uh, whatever, come here. I, I only talked about certain specific things in this video. A reminder, just because I didn't mention the specific thing that you wanted to hear an update on doesn't mean that it's gone forever. It just means I have no new news to present now, but Ask a question in the comments. I'll be in there. I'll be replying to things. If you're looking for an update on a specific thing, I will respond, but be prepared that maybe the answer might be we don't have anything new to tell you about it at this point. But believe me, if there's something that you like that you're like, boy, I really wish that more of this would happen, we probably do too, and I bet you we've talked about it. But we only want to tell you things when we've actually made firm plans. Otherwise, it's... It's just weird and disappointing. So uh, thanks for being cool, though. I'll, I'll, you're standing awfully close now. You can you can actually back up now. Thanks. Thanks again. Bye.